Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name's Chrissy. I'm really pleased to meet you. I've been away for two weeks, but I'm back now. I'm going to do a full look with one palette today. I'm going to use the new collaboration with Revolution. It's from Makeup by Jack. If you'd like to see the four looks, please stay tuned. So that is the front of it. It's a nice and matte black, and then you've got Jack's name there in like a, a shiny shiny black it's a really nice looking palette. this is the palette for really four different sections you've got this one here then there then there then there so you've got five different colors in each section it's nice if you if you like makeup but you're not 100 percent sure on what colors go with what so it is a very good idea of his so we are going to do four different looks today what i'm going to do is i'm going to do one on each eye twice um so i'm not going to do a full face today first time back in two weeks i cannot believe how long i've been gone as you can see my background's changed i've had all my room done what i'll do is i will give you a room tour on another video so i think we're going to start with i think i've done this one first i will put swatches of them all i've already done the uh, the swatches for you so i should do that and then on the, on the side of the screen you'll actually get my arm swatch with the colors on so we're going to do that as number one I'm going to be taking this first colour here. This is just a bone coloured matte shade. This burnt orange colour. So I'm going to apply that to the crease. and I'm going to use this brown colour here nice chocolate brown and I'm going to um, just concentrate on the edges we're going to go with this shade of shoe it's in the, in the line this bronzy coloured shade here Um, just blend a little bit more just on top of where I've put that foil shade I'm just going to add that to the inner corners just to brighten them up again. This is look two. I'm going to use this quarter of the palette. So you've got a couple of purples, a brown, a coral, and a silver. Actually, start with a deeper shade, which is the uh, the purple aubergine colour. So I'm just going to um, add it to the out, outer edges and then I'm just going to follow my eye socket. Just tapping it, I'm not going to blend anything out yet, so I'm just going to um, just apply in the colour. lighter shade of purple now just to start blending out so I'm just diffusing this darker colour with the lighter colour
So I've took that right up to my eyebrow though. So I'm just going to leave this little part here and I'll, I'll, I can add a very light colour there. I am going to take a tiny little bit of this coral. I'm going to run the brown underneath my eye. So, on to the third and fourth looks. So, we've got um, some deep reds and we've got orange brown. Uh, this is a uh, champagne shimmer and this looks like um, a red, well, a red colour shimmer. this red, deep red down first. Okay, I'm just going to blend it out slightly with this orange colour. Sorry. This orange colour. Right, I've got the brown, which is this one here. I'm just going to uh, run that on the outside. I'm just going to just swipe that down. It is really, really nice. Use this shimmer, this champagne coloured shimmer. Some eyeliner and some um, some mascara as well, and so I'll be back in a second. That's the finished look for the third quarter of the, uh, the palette. I like this one. For the fourth look, we're going to take these five here. So we've got the two dark blues, the yellow, the gold, and the silver grey. With the yellow as the base. We'll be able to see that just peeking, peeking um, above the other colours when we uh, when we put them down. Quite a decent covering. 
I can go in after as well if, uh, if need be. I'm going to, I'm going to do it sort of opposite. I'm going to do the dark blue first and then I'm going to blend it out with the, the lighter blue. this other blue now, which is this one. Looks like this it is instantly going green. going to take this gold, the large pan, and it's the gold one. I may run some silver underneath the, the eye, just so I've used all of the colours. Ooh, pretty. This is full of glitter. I don't know whether it's because it's gold, but it's it's just just wow. If you still want me to carry on doing my base and my blushes and my um, my contours, please let me know. It's just I'd rather I would really really just rather concentrate on the eyes but I will carry on if you want me to but as I say let me know and I'll do whichever you ask. Eventually, after putting a little bit of mascara on and a little bit of eyeliner, we have a sort of finished look. So that, that is the um, that is the last quarter, which is this one, this quarter of the palette. So, as you can see, and as I've demonstrated, it is a really, really versatile palette with a lot of looks. For ten pound, how many you get? You're getting twenty shades for ten pound. So obviously fifty pence each. Four of those are, uh, are the larger shades too. So um, I think it's really worth it. Um, but let me know down in the comments what you think and which one was your favourite look. If you've actually got one. My well, lovelies, I've come to the end of my video today. Now I know it was a little bit different. It was my first time back and I thought I'd just try just try something different just to see if you'd like it. If you have, please let me know down in the comments. But if you have liked it, give us a like. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. But just before I go, I'd just like to send a massive shout out to Sharon Ann Anti-Aging. She's always there for me. She's always checking up on me to see if I'm okay, if I haven't uh, filmed or anything. So please, if you've got any any queries regarding anti-aging, please head over to Sharon's channel. I will link it down below in my description box. So until we see each other again, probably next week, love you loud. See you soon. Bye.